After a fantastic night last night at the fair, we now find ourselves inside the Eurostar structure. Um, in a few moments we'll be walking up the lift hill, we should get some quite interesting video diet up there. But uh, you realise when you're down here just how big a structure it is and how close all the supports are. It's just a massive jigsaw. Take a look. Right, I suppose lift walkers want to come over. Again, I'll, I'll reiterate the point again. You're going to go up the lift? Well, yeah. I'll see. <laughs> see how far I get. Dave, you're going to go up the lift? Oh yes, definitely. It's an opportunity not to be missed. <laughs> Here we have Phil taking his first yeah. step. One, one giant leap oh, no. for man. <laughs> 120 foot lift hill, or whatever how high it is. That's it, that's as far as I'm going. <laughs> oh, a bit high, he says. <laughs> well, we're just a quarter of the way up now. I'm what changing my this? changing my film. It's very, very slippery. It's uh, been raining last night and obviously we've not got climbing footwear on. And, uh, Justin. You were boring me, Mark. <laughs> you were boring me. Right, we've made it to the top of Eurostar now, and uh, I guess a few of us got shaky legs, but incredible view. And uh, a bit slippy, as I say. And Star World. Yeah, it's been a fabulous first half an hour today, all from the lift and everywhere, but uh, I think we're being called back now, so better go and have some rides. <laughs> On this... Monster. Okay, after doing Eurostar, this is the very good Star World ride. Uh, we're inside here, as you can see, it's just a twisted, massive track. Have a look.
Ja, Deutschland, das kann man ja sehen. Das sieht man ja als Asyl. Komm mal her, Mann, komm mal her. Very quiet area. Ja, das ist ein Ort, das ist ein Ort. Ja, das ist ein Ort. Thank you. 